the most common skin conditions in the world, affecting an estimated 85% of young adults. One trusted source. Conventional acne treatments like salicylic acid, niacinamide, or benzyl peroxide are proven to be the most effective acne solutions, but they can be expensive and have undesirable side effects, such as dryness, redness, and irritation. This has prompted many people to look into remedies to cure acne naturally at home. In fact, one study found that 77% of acne patients have tried alternative acne treatments. Many home remedies lack scientific backing, and further research on their effectiveness is needed. If you're looking for alternative treatments, though, there are still options you can try. What causes acne? Acne starts when the pores in your skin get clogged with oil and dead skin cells. Each pore is connected to a sebaceous gland, which produces an oily substance called sebum. Extra sebum can plug pores, causing the growth of a bacteria known as Propionibacterium acnes, or P. acnes. White blood cells attack P. acnes, leading to skin inflammation and acne. Some cases of acne are more severe than others, but common symptoms include whiteness, blackness, and pimples. Many factors may contribute to the development of acne, including genetics, diet, stress, hormone changes, infections, standard clinical treatments are the most effective for reducing acne. You can also try home treatments, though more research on their effectiveness is needed. Below are 13 home remedies for acne. Apply apple cider vinegar. Apple cider vinegar is made by fermenting apple cider or the unfiltered juice from pressed apples. Like other vinegar, it's known for its ability to fight many types of bacteria and fungi. 3 Trusted Source 4 Trusted Source. Apple cider vinegar contains organic acids, such as citric acid, that have been found to kill P. acnes. 5 Trusted Source. Research has shown that citric acid, another organic acid, suppresses inflammation caused by P. acnes, which may prevent scarring. 6 Trusted Source. Lactic acid, another acid in apple cider vinegar, may also improve the appearance of acne scars. 7 Trusted Source 8. While certain components of apple cider vinegar may help with acne, there's currently no evidence to support its use for this purpose. Some dermatologists advise against using apple cider vinegar at all, as it may irritate the skin. HOW to use it mix one part apple cider vinegar in three parts water. Use more water for sensitive skin. After cleansing, gently apply the mixture to the skin using a cotton ball. LET for 5 20 seconds. Rinse with water and pack dry. Repeat this process one two times per day as needed. It is important to note that applying apple cider vinegar to your skin can cause burns and irritation. If you choose to try it, use it in small amounts and dilute it with water. The organic acids in apple cider vinegar may help kill acne causing bacteria and reduce the appearance of scars. Applying it to the skin may cause burns or irritation, so it should be used carefully. 2. Take a zinc supplement. Zinc is an essential nutrient that's important for cell growth, hormone production, metabolism, and immune function. It is relatively well studied compared with other natural treatments for acne. Research indicates that people with acne tend to have lower levels of zinc in their blood than those with clear skin. 9 Trusted Source. Several studies have also shown that taking zinc orally may help reduce acne. For example, a 2014 review found that zinc is more effective at treating severe and inflammatory acne than treating moderate. Acne. 10 Trusted Source. The optimal dosage of zinc for acne has not been established, but several older studies have observed a significant reduction in acne using 30 45 mg of elemental zinc per day. 11 Trusted Source. 12 Trusted Source. 13 Trusted Source. Elemental zinc refers to the amount of zinc that's present in the compound. Zinc is available in many forms and contains varying amounts of elemental zinc. Zinc oxide contains the highest amount of elemental zinc at 80 percent. THA recommended safe upper limit. Probably best to not exceed that amount, unless you're under the supervision of a medical doctor. Not taking too much zinc may cause adverse effects, including stomach pain and gut irritation. That applying zinc to the skin has not been shown to be effective. This may be because zinc is not effectively absorbed through the skin. Individuals with acne tend to have lower zinc levels than people with clear skin. Several studies suggest that taking zinc orally may reduce acne. 3. Make a honey and cinnamon mask. Honey and cinnamon have the ability to fight bacteria and reduce inflammation, which are two factors that trigger acne. A 2019 study found that the combination of honey and cinnamon bark extract exerted antibacterial effects against P. acnes. Other research has indicated that honey on its own can block the growth of kill P. acnes, although this finding doesn't necessarily mean that honey effectively treats acne. A study in 136 people with acne found that applying honey to the skin after using antibacterial soap was no more effective at treating acne than using the soap on its own. While the anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties of honey and cinnamon may reduce acne, more research is needed. HOW to make a honey and cinnamon mess mix two tablespoons of honey and one teaspoon of cinnamon to form a paste after cleansing. Apply the mask to your face and leave it on for 10 or 15 minutes. Rinse the mask on the face and pat your face dry. Honey and cinnamon have anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties. They may help reduce acne. 
but more studies are needed for. Spot treat with tea tree oil Tea tree oil is an essential oil that's extracted from the leaves of Melaleuca alternifolia, a small tree native to Australia. It is well known for its ability to fight bacteria and reduce skin inflammation. What's more, several studies have found that applying tea tree oil to the skin may reduce acne. Another small study found that, compared with benzoyl peroxide, participants using a tea tree oil ointment for acne experienced less dry skin and irritation. They also felt more satisfied with the treatment given that topical and oral antibiotics can cause bacterial resistance if used long-term for acne. Tea tree oil may be an effective substance. Tea tree oil is very potent, so always dilute it before applying it to your skin. How to use it? Mix one part tea tree oil with nine parts water. Dip a cotton swab into the mixture and apply it to the affected areas. Apply moisturizer if desired. Repeat this process one two times per day as needed. Tea tree oil has strong antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties. Applying it to the skin may reduce acne. Apply green tea to your skin. Green tea is very high in antioxidants, and drinking it can promote good health. It may also help reduce acne. This is likely because the polyphenols in green tea help fight bacteria and reduce inflammation, which are two main causes of acne. There isn't much research exploring the benefits of drinking green tea when it comes to acne, and more studies are needed. I am one small study with 80 women participants with 1,500 milligrams of green tea extract daily for four weeks. By the end of the study. Development of acne many studies also indicate that applying green tea directly to the skin may help with acne. Research shows that the main antioxidant in green tea, epigallocatechin 3 gallate (EGCG), reduces sebum production, fights inflammation, and inhibits the growth of pea acne in individuals with acne-prone skin. Multiple studies have found that applying green tea extract to the skin significantly reduces sebum production and pimples in those with acne. You can buy creams and lotions that contain green tea just as easy to make your own mixture at home. four minutes. Allow the tea to cool using a cotton ball. Apply the tea to your skin or pour it into a spray bottle to spritz it on. Allow it to dry. Then rinse it off with water and pat your skin dry. You can also add the remaining tea leaves to honey and make a mask. Green tea is high in antioxidants that help fight bacteria and reduce inflammation. Some research indicates that applying green tea extract to the skin may reduce acne. Point six. Apply witch hazel. Witch hazel is extracted from the bark and leaves of the North American witch hazel shrub. properties that's why it's used to treat a broad range of skin conditions including dandruff, eczema, varicose veins, burns, bruises, insect bites, and acne. Currently, there appears to be very little research on which hazel's ability to treat acne specifically. In one small study funded by a skincare company, 30 individuals with mild or moderate acne used a three-step facial treatment twice daily for six weeks. Which hazel was one of the ingredients in the second step of the treatment. Most participants experienced significant improvement in their acne by the end of the study. Research also suggests that witch hazel may fight bacteria and reduce skin irritation and inflammation, which can contribute to acne. How to use it? Come in one tablespoon of witch hazel bark and one cup of water in a small saucepan. Soak the witch hazel for 30 minutes and then bring the mixture to a boil on the stove. Reduce it to a simmer and cover it for 10 minutes. Remove the mixture from the heat and let it sit for an additional 10 minutes. Strain and store the liquid in a sealed container. Apply it. in the distillation process applying witch hazel to the skin may reduce irritation and inflammation. It may be beneficial for individuals with acne, but more research is needed. Point 7. Moisturize with aloe vera. Aloe vera is a tropical plant whose leaves produce a clear gel. The gel is often added to lotions, creams, ointments, and soaps. It is commonly used to treat abrasions, rashes, burns, and other skin conditions. When applied to the skin, aloe vera gel can help heal the leaves, treat burns, and fight inflammation. Aloe vera contains salicylic acid and sulfur, which are both used extensively in the treatment of acne. Research has found that applying salicylic acid to the skin reduces acne. Several studies have also indicated that aloe vera gel, when combined with other substances like tretinoin cream or tea tree oil, may improve acne. While research shows promise, the anti-acne benefits of aloe vera itself require further scientific research. How to use it? Spread the gel from the aloe plant out with a spoon. Apply the gel directly to clean skin. As
as a moisturizer repeat one two times per day or as desired you can also buy aloe vera gel from the store but make sure that it's pure aloe without any added ingredients when applied to the skin aloe vera gel can help heal wounds treat burns and fight inflammation it may be beneficial for individuals with acne but more research is needed point a take a fish oil supplement omega-3 fatty acids are healthy fats that offer a multitude of health benefits you must get these fats from your diet but research shows that most people who eat a standard western diet don't get enough of them fish oils contain two main types of omega-3 fatty acids the cosapentaenoic acid epa and the cosahexaenoic acid dot dot high levels of epa and da have been shown to decrease inflammatory factors which may reduce the risk of acne in one study 45 individuals with acne were given omega-3 fatty acid supplements containing both EPA and DA daily. After 10 weeks, their acne decreased significantly. There's no specific recommended daily intake of omega-3 fatty acids. The 2015-2020 Dietary Guidelines for Americans recommends that healthy adults consume around 250 mg of combined EPA and DA each day. You can also get omega-3 fatty acids by eating salmon, sardines, anchovies, walnuts, chia seeds, and ground flax seeds. Fish oil. Once the topmost layer of skin is removed. Currently, the research on exfoliation and its ability to treat acne is limited. Some studies suggest that microdermabrasion, a method of exfoliation, can improve the skin's appearance, including some cases of acne scarring. In one small study, 38 patients with acne received eight microdermabrasion treatments at weekly intervals. The participants with acne scars showed some improvements following the treatment. 51 trusted source. Another small study found that six weekly microdermabrasion treatments help stimulate skin repair. While these results indicate that exfoliation may improve skin health and appearance, more research is needed on acne. There are a wide variety of exfoliation products available, but you can also make a scrub at home using sugar or salt. Note that mechanical exfoliation, such as harsh scrubs or brushes, can be irritating and damaging the skin. As such, some dermatologists recommend gentle chemical exfoliation. rub your skin to avoid damaging it. HOW to make a scrub at home mix equal parts sugar or salt and coconut oil. Gently rub your skin with the mixture and rinse well. Exfoliate as often as desired, up to once daily. Exfoliation is the process of removing the top layer of dead skin cells. It may reduce the appearance of scars and discoloration, but more research needs to be done on its ability to treat acne. Point one. Follow a low glycemic load D3 relationship between diet and acne has been debated for years. Research suggests that dietary factors, such as insulin and glycemic index, may be associated with acne. A food's glycemic index, GI, is a measure of how quickly it raises your blood sugar. Eating high GI foods causes a spike in insulin, which likely increases sebum production. As a result, high GI foods may directly affect the development and severity of acne. Foods with a high glycemic index include processed foods, such as white bread, sugary soft drinks, cakes, donuts, pastries, candies, sugary breakfast cereals. Foods with a low glycemic index include fruits, vegetables, legumes, nuts, whole or minimally processed grains. In one study, 66 people followed either a normal or low glycemic diet. After two weeks, the individuals consuming a low glycemic diet had lower levels of insulin like growth factor 1, IGF 1, a hormone involved in acne development. Another study in 64 people found that those with moderate or severe acne ate diets with more carbohydrates and a higher glycemic load than those without acne. These small studies suggest that a low glycemic diet may help those with acne grow skin. Additional larger longer studies are needed. Eating high glycemic foods may increase sebum production and contribute to acne. More research is needed to determine whether a low glycemic diet can treat or help prevent acne. Point one one. Cut back on dairy The relationship between dairy and acne is highly controversial. Milk and dairy products contain hormones like IGF-1, which is associated with acne. Other hormones in milk may cause hormonal changes and lead to acne. One study in people ages 10 to 24 found that drinking whole milk three or more days each week was linked to moderate or severe acne in another study including 114 participants, those with acne were found to drink significantly more.
more milk than people. Have acne on the other hand. A study involving over 20,000 adults found no association between milk consumption and acne participants self-reported the data in these studies. So more research needs to be done to establish a true causal relationship. Not finally, several research reviews have suggested an association between dairy consumption and acne. The relationship between milk and acne needs further study. Dots of studies have found a positive association between drinking milk and acne. Limiting milk and dairy consumption research is needed point one two reduce stress link between stress and acne is not fully understood the hormones released during periods of stress may increase sebum production in the body which could be linked to acne of Health and Human Services recommends that adults get 150 minutes of aerobic exercise and engage in strength training activities two days per week. This can include walking, hiking, running, and lifting weights. To sum it all up. Exercise affects several factors that may improve acne. These include promoting healthy blood circulation and helping reduce stress. Acne is a common problem with a number of underlying causes. Experts agree that conventional treatments like salicylic acid, or benzoyl peroxide are still the most effective, though some may find these irritating. Many people choose to try natural remedies. Most home remedies.